It is Monday, November 4th of 2019, and today on Retro's Remakes and Remasters, we will be playing Resident Evil 2. Welcome to the stream. Look at this. Look at this. This is just beautiful. I guess it's it's over here for me. Um, my my lovely, lovely wife has been continually adding more, uh, more and more things to make the stream gorgeous. Um, I'm really excited about uh, a lot of the changes uh, that we are working on. Mostly just some some simple graphical stuff, and I've been changing a few things a little bit behind the scenes to try to make the stream a little bit smoother. Um, it's actually I'm actually a lot less stressed about a lot of things. Um, at first, I, I, I de definitely freak out about uh, a lot of the the function and the know how and the you know just trying to not have technical issues. But but now when I, I'm because I'm, I'm just looking at it because I think it's beautiful. Um, the more and more uh, we add and the more and more I do and, and whatnot, I, I just feel great. Like, I, I love streaming already, but just adding more things and just things working better, I feel great. It's awesome. Welcome to the show, though. Retros, remakes, and remasters, where we take a game that is old, old and made new in this case. Resident Evil 2, they remade it, and it's very different from the original. The fun part about this is I actually don't remember the original all that much, um, and I've, I've heard glowing reviews of this game, and I think part of me has always just wanted to stream playing this game, because it just sounds like awesome. Hey, what is up, RTC Gaming, or right in the childhood? Um, it is it is a great night. We are, we are excited. We are pumped up. We have way too much uh, energy right now. Um, it is Monday, um, so you'll know that it is my Friday, because uh, I work over the weekend like a madman, and I make money, but uh, I try to try to have a good time on my, my days off, and that's why I fill a lot of it with streaming right now. Don't you laugh at me. My wife is encouraging me. She's always, always by my side, usually often off camera, but... Um, she usually likes to be behind the camera. She's a she's an artiste, as it were. Um, what did I do? Oh yeah, you can. Yeah. My wife is concerned about my my backgrounds and such. Yeah, no, it's probably smart. I mean, I mean, I got the the fan in the back. It's it's fine. It's fine. We're we're all nice and close in this this nice tight room here. <laughs> we are doing well though. So anyway, I'm really excited to play this game. I have not. Uh, I've actually avoided. I believe this game came out in. February? It was either late January, early February of this year, I believe. And I have avoided a lot of it, like the plague, um, just because I was really excited to see uh, how it was going to work and how what it was going to what it was going to be like. And I don't want to see any spoilers because I I generally know how the how the game goes, and I know certain characters make it and who don't. In a in a little bit of a way, I might I might remember some things, but at the same time, it is a remake, so. Like in the last game, I mean, they, they did a few things to kind of mold uh, the Resident Evil storyline back into uh, what it has become. I'm just going to start up the game here. Um, yeah, they did a few different things to kind of, for people who know the series and for the later installments, they've added some more things and more story plot points and different characters and other things. And by going back and redoing the games, they had the ability to kind of, you know, softly write in a few more hints about what they're going to do. Because, I mean, obviously, when you're when you're making a video game, you're not like, and this is going to go on for, like, another seven games. And, like, you know, the plan is to make it this beautiful, overarching narrative. Because that's, that's totally uh, everyone's plan. All right. Pulling in the, the game audio here. Hopefully it sounds all good. All good. Um, again, um, spending as much time on the screen as possible because my wife literally just whipped it up today. And we're going to be adding more to, to the stream, but like, again, so happy. Head over heels with this woman, she's crazy and I love her. Okay, we're going to, we're going to, we're going to pop over to some game view here. Cause I, I'm just, I've seen, oh, there we go, I've seen very little of this game so far. I, uh, the other day I, uh, I pulled it up just to see if I could, uh, if it would run okay. Let's see. I'm gonna move some, some windows around here just so I am comfy and cozy. Um, but yeah, no, I, I was, I, I spent like a good, it was a solid like 30 seconds in game and I was like, yep, it's running fine. <laughs> because, oh gosh, I'm, I'm really, really excited for it. It's gonna be great. 
And now I'm fighting the urge to sneeze. I'm gonna double check everything. We're sounds good, audio, everything. We're looking solid. Um, uh, I, I looked at some of the controls and other things before, so I think I'm good to go. It even has a continue. <laughs> this game is so fun. I'm really pumped for it. Like, hardcore pumped for it. Um, I'm gonna say new game. It has continue. I literally was in the game for 30 seconds. I have no idea what happened. But they're like, do you want to continue from that, that very point that you were in because you accomplished nothing, loser? Um, <laughs> all right. Oh, the excitement, the energy. <laughs> um, you know what? We're going to take our time. Not worrying about it. All right, so don't die. I'm going to die a lot. I'm very tempted, super tempted right now. Is I know there's a, a quote-unquote hardcore mode. I don't believe it's like a, a permadeath situation. But it does invoke the use of uh, of ink ribbons. And the enemies are a lot harder. And I've kind of, I kind of really want to try that. Just, as, just to see how the difficulty curve goes. I feel like that would be fun. I, I might try that. I might have to try that. Um, but the, the, the real question is, who do we want to start with? Um, so Claire Redfield, see a different nightmare awaits Claire Redfield, who is unaware of just how drastically her very ordinary life is about to change. Maybe she should have talked to her brother or cousin, or I, don't, I think they're brother and sister. Claire's is easier. Okay, I was imagining that was the case, just because that's how they did it with uh, Jill and Chris in the first game. Let's see, Leon S. Kennedy, after a few days of radio silence from his new post, Leon S. Kennedy drives to Raccoon City. First mistake. To scope things out, unbeknownst to him, a nightmare awaits. You did Leon first? Okay. See, I was leaning towards doing Leon first since I did I did Jill first last time. And gosh, don't even don't even remind me. Like I'm realizing I'm just like a I might be an RE fanboy at this point because I I already want to go back and finish up Chris's storyline. We're gonna we might actually do that at some point if I have some extra time for more streaming. Um. I, I really want to start with Leon first, and I kind of really want to do it on hard mode, and I really think I'm going to cry. <laughs> it might be really bad. I'm not sure. We're, we're going we're gonna to figure this out right here, right now. Oh, I'm just... I'm so content. I can't... couldn't be happier. I, I might murder this cursor. Good gravy. All right. Right, we're just gonna we're just gonna do it good luck with that thank you we're gonna have fun dying tonight all right we're going with leon so this is the question because it's assisted standard your normal gameplay and then hardcore um so there's no auto saves goodness uh yeah saving requires ink ribbons like i said and stronger enemies and so this is for hardcore fans of the series i don't know if i'm that hardcore um I, I, I really want to try it. <laughs> Hardcore, yes. I really think I really think that's the play here. So as you'll notice, uh, I'm playing with controller. Uh, I've mentioned before, uh, I was a I was a console shooter gamer guy before I got onto PC gaming and, and played a lot more shooters on PC. Um, now, if I wanted to be legit, I would probably actually switch to mouse, because I'm actually not too bad with the aiming and the whatnots. But, uh, part of me likes to just sit back and have a controller, so we, we'll, we're will we gonna see how uh, sticking with controller goes, as long as I don't have to stick with the tank controls, man. I, I really thought I'd be good at tank controls. Hardcore game mode requires the use of ink ribbons to save. Wow, they're really drilling this into me, like, dude. Auto saving's not happening. Like, if you haven't played video games before, like, 2004, like, you just, you need to be ready for this. Like, there's no going back. In addition, there's no auto save in this game mode, like I said. Start a new game in hardcore mode. Hardcore mode! We're doing it. Okay. Awesome. More high energy energy drink. Raccoon City is an industrial city in the heart of America, and the loading times are nothing. <laughs> Look, man, I'm serious, okay? I still have some my own eyes. Oh, I believe you, buddy. I believe you. <laughs> Just tell us a story. Tell us a story. Tell us a story. It was last mm. Friday night. I was oh, yeah. Mm. This woman started coming towards me. 
Shindy? You know, so I, I figured she was drunk. <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, tell us, be honest now, how many drinks did you have? <laughs> oh man, I, I barely had a buzz on. Oh, come on. Look, just listen, all right? She got this is Chris after he got out of the mansion. <laughs> you had to see her eyes, her nose, her whole face. It looked like it was rotting. Yes. She looked like a corpse. That's this guy's eating a burger. <laughs> Sounds like my wife. Oh! Shots fired on the wife. Alright, calm down, buddy. Calm down. Just, hey, you gotta stay strong. Okay? Don't give in to fear out there, right? Yeah, well, you got that right. If you freeze up around these things, you'll sink to the Oh, come on. See, this guy's really gonna have to pay attention to this knowledge he's been handed real soon. I'm sure of it. We might turn down the volume just a little bit. We'll see. I need some sleep. Oh, shit! Woo! Okay. Woof, dude. Oh, so that's all up in your, uh... Yeah, touching, touching someone who's been hit like that might not be the best thing. Check for a pulse, but don't move them. Because if there's anything left, that's just gonna hurt. What am I gonna do? I could've said hit and run. Okay. That's... That's a classic start to a zombie film. The RPD! Leon. Hardcore man. Miz Oil. My favorite place for oil and Miz. Oh. Can we drive a Jeep? Graphics in this are great. My graphic oh, settings no. aren't that high right now, but like, it's a really good looking game. That's weird. That's weird. Yes, we are open. Open for zombie business. Mm. <laughs> That's weird. Loud sounds. I guess those bloody footprints might mean something. Alright. Explore your surroundings. There's a cop car. Ooh, is there a gun? Look around. Okay, that, that centers my camera view. Good to know. Um, is there left sticks to walk if you've never played a video game? Oh, click and left stick to run. Okay. When life has you seen red, enjoy the wild taste of dingo red cigarettes. Get wild. Now on sale. I love getting wild, let me tell you. That's why we're doing hardcore! Hardcore. Hardcore parkour. I'm wiping myself off. Alright, we should probably really go in there and help those sad crying people. Alright. We're about to, to hit where, as far as I got. <laughs> Alright, Leon Kennedy. Raccoon... Uh, well, Raccoon City Police there? Department. I'm trying to figure out what's going on. Hmm. All the lights are out, too. That's, that's really Something's creepy. Not right. Something. The lights, the blood. Not sure what it could be. Someone's fighting in the back. You alright? You okay, bro? Don't okay. Move. I'll be back for you. Alright. Right when I open this door, this is about as far as I got. And I quit right in the middle of this little cutscene. So it's all new now. Officer, you need help? Stay back, sir, I got this. Dude, it's not Oh crap. Oh. Ooh, that's that's juicy. Freeze! I'll shoot! Whoa, okay. Good lord, yeah. Alright, yeah, I need, I need to take this more seriously. Son of a bitch. 
What the? All right. Okay. All right, I'm already dying. Oh, dude, is there like poison slash like bite wound death? Like, oh, dude. Oh, Leon, you're so hurt already. I'm so sorry. Let's steal this guy's keys. That'll make me feel better. Key. Wow, already? I know, right? <laughs> I really thought three headshots would have been enough, but uh, then again, I, I do remember hearing that uh, it takes a lot of shots. Holy junk. This this is this is an exciting place to work, let me tell you. All right. <laughs> yeah, so we're in danger. Uh, we're in a high amount of danger. Oh, I got an orientation letter. Okay, this is the perfect time. <laughs> All right, we'll we'll try and heal up before we start reading about how uh, how much they love us down at RPD. All right, let's run or hobble. Excuse me. Oh, well we're already dead. I think. I think we probably should have just ran. Oh, that was a great shot. No. This can't be. All right, we're just booking it. Not sure what to do. Not sure where to go. I'm sure I'm already gonna get cussed out. Hey, what are you doing? <laughs> That guy's a jerk. <laughs> this is great! I'm so excited to have to start this over again already. Yep, yeah, that's bad. And we're dead. <laughs> yes. Oh, man. I miss the QTE days, man. It's too bad. <laughs> Whoa. Dude, the deaths in this are great! I'm already loving this. Oh man, okay. Let's try that again, shall we? Oh, that was that was beautiful. Oh, this is great. <laughs> okay. Death count one. Perfect. Whew. Oh man. Today's gonna be a good day. It's gonna be a good night of streaming. Can I call for help? <laughs> Which I so desperately currently need. Um, all right, yeah, it's got to teach us everything again. Let's take a look around a little bit more before we go helping people. Oh man, yeah, I didn't fight the zombie when I was testing for <laughs> for everything else. <laughs> Hello. Oh, that was amazing. There? Oh, it was so much fun. I'm so excited to just be terrible at this. Something's not right. Something's not right. Thank you, Leon. Okay. Yeah, so we're gonna have to come through that door more than likely, because this jerk face is gonna block off the rest right. of the, the area. Over there. I'll be back for you. Alrighty, let's do this. Let's do this. We got this. No problems. No problem. I wonder if I take out his kneecaps, if that would actually be better for me. Stay back, sir. I got this. But look at the throwdown that the zombie puts in this dude. Like, like I can't even believe. Right. We're gonna we're gonna turn down some sounds here. Real soon. Freeze! I'll shoot! Alright, let's shit! What the Got a lighter. All right, past, past the naked ladies. All right, when you need to use an item to unlock a door or solve a puzzle, select the item and then the use command. I wonder if that's in real time as well. That'll be good. Good to know. We'll figure that out. All right. Whoa! That was a- oh gosh. That was a whiff if I've ever seen one. Alright. Yeah, we can make it past him. Or not. <laughs> alright, alright. Claire? Don't shoot! Get down! That one went down one shot. <laughs> What is this BS? Alright, we're in a hard mode, it's fine. You alright? Oh, he's even got the, think so. the nibble. Thanks. You can thank me later, when we're safe. Holy shit. Like the car wasn't 
there in the first place. Can I real quick? No, no. On. I don't know. Hopefully they'll have some answers at the police station. Wait, you're a cop? Yeah, Leon Kennedy. You are? Claire. Claire Redfield. Live around here? No. I'm looking for my brother. He's a cop too. Christopher. Oh, it's a good thing we found each other. I don't know what to expect anymore. To Raccoon City, home of Umbrella. We sell soap and not zombie vaccines. Promise. I love I love dying before late title cards. It's that's just the best thing. <laughs> uh so good, so good. I'm thinking on how I want to play this. Um, again, never played it before. Don't know 100 percent what it'll be like. But uh, I kind of want to play, I don't want to, I want to look around and enjoy everything, but at the same time I don't want to dawdle too much. I want to try and at least play it like a, like I mean it here. <laughs> try and, try and make it through hardcore mode. Uh, it's already, it's already going to turn out to be really, really interesting. <laughs> oh, that's cute. What's the evil? It's in the city lights. Also, the fact that they colored the letters in the title to Attention, call out the citizens. abbreviation is great. Due to the citywide outbreak, you were advised to take shelter at the Raccoon City Police Station. Free food and medical supplies will be provided to everyone in need. Oh my god, this is so unreal. The police station's not much farther. They'll know something. Yeah, but what if we're the only ones? What if there's no survivors? No, there's survivors. It's a big city. There has to be. Dead end, of course. And is this post blowing up the mansion? Like, did that just set everything free? <laughs> Looks like we're walking from here. It's like we're walking from here. More like running. Yeah, good call. <laughs> How did we get snuck up on? You gotta back up. <laughs> Zombie bus drivers. Damn. Oh, this guy shit. You got it. Get out now! Hold on. Jeez. Oh, good. The gasoline. Claire dead? Do, do we care? She alright? Oh, no. ah! Guess that was a bigger uh, concern. Claire! Claire, are you okay? Everybody, they've all turned. 
Okay. Okay. How much ammo do I have? Yeah, four bullets. Great. Thinking I need to start taking out people's kneecaps. There it is. The station. It looks close. May I? No, I may not. Okay, it's gonna tumble out. There it goes. Don't worry about it, don't worry about it. It's fine, it's fine. And close it. Lock it before Claire gets back. It's probably already here. Alright, real quick. Welcome to the city of the dead. You already died once, you loser. Alright. Let's see what I can do. I might turn down the audio just a little bit. Um, just a bit. Don't want to be going crazy with it. That's yeah, a little bit better. All right. They're not getting through that, as far as I can tell. I mean, everyone watching, everyone who's seen this game before is just like, he's wrong, but... It's good that he feels safe, you know? At least he's at least he's feeling safe. That's that's what matters. What was he doing? I'm gonna try to clean my gun up. Oh dang. Keep out. I mean it did say keep out. Well I'm glad I opened that. That I feel safe now. I probably need to go through that. Let's double check. Hello? Is anybody here? Oh, is there ink ribbons? Thank God. <laughs> Typewriter. Perfect. Perfect. Oh, it's a cutscene. That's why. <laughs> there has to be someone here. I mean, if there's no zombies here, I'll be happy. That very much is true. Not clear. Not good. It's not good. David, Marvin, you there? I found a way out. It's in here. Found a way out. Is that like a key card? Great. Send reinforcements. East hallway. East hallway. Okay. Okay. I mean, he's probably gotta dead, but guy. gotta find that guy. All right. I'm very tempted between saving now. That guy can't outrun a zombie, apparently. Yeah, no, zombies are fast, especially when you're diabetic. All right, we're gonna we're gonna just save right now, just because I'm probably gonna die a lot, and we don't need to we don't need to be replaying the same things over and over again. All right, all right, east hallway. We got a map. The map screen is useful for more than just your current location and surroundings. It can also show you any points of interest and in items you have found but haven't picked up yet. Okay, so it's just like the other game. Alright, we're in the main hallway. We need to go to the east hallway. And that's the door that I literally just opened. Uh, oh, it lets you know where the, half the items are. Let's go grab that junk right now. We're gonna grab the spray and then we'll go save what's his face. Oh look, there's already places to put things. Also, Leon sounds like he's having a hard time moving. Oh, it's near it's near where I'm going. Alright. Perfect. Perfect, perfect. We got this. Hardcore mode, no problem. Ink ribbons and all. Love me some ink ribbons. We're doing this. Alright, let's go, Leon! Save this guy. Or what's left of him. That floor is disgusting. Let's do it. Yeah, I got like zero ammo too. This is gonna be great, man. I'm excited. I'm all sorts of excited. We're gonna get got. Okay. <laughs> okay. Yeah, that's that's me at, at the point of uh Oh is this... <laughs> it looked at the fuse box, but it was giving me the description of the gun and I was like, I don't think you can shoot a fuse box. Alright. Okay. Alright, so we don't have anything for that, obviously. Let's check our back... our point of ingress here. Alright. We're gonna... we're gonna take this slow. Frick, if I remember Resident Evil 2 right, 
they love shoot or pushing people out of or whose idea was it to take the fuse away good question they're like maybe the zombies can't see in the dark and then the zombies perfectly saw them and they're like well i guess there's no point putting it back in all right not about this not about <laughs> just like i would be in this situation you got this okay all right you're very believable okay either we go in where there's a lot of loud noises or we go this way i think the guy's this way and i don't want to have to go in a room with just a bunch of zombies just yet if it's at all possible the hydrant do we want to start the water okay is there a quick turn button i'm sure it'll tell me in a minute hydrant can't turn that on okay Jesus. Died for your sins. Open up. Hurry! Open up! You in here? Open this goddamn door! Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I'll get you out! Oh, we gotta get a fuse, don't we? Please! We'll take that at least. Me. Yeah, we can slide him out. He just needs some space. He's gonna get his legs nipped on. Your goodness. At this point, just I knew that was coming. Jesus Christ. I was gonna say, at least just give him, just give him a nice bit of lead and call it a day. All right. Well. Oh, officer's notebook. He likes to make doodles. Okay, officer's notebook. Got a statue medallions question mark he's been he's been reading about the da vinci code i guess a parking lot a way out i like the idea that he said i got a way out it's in here and it's just like hey there's a parking lot for this police station is that what's happening unless it's secret it might be secret that's why he's like medallions it does look like a secret bait a secret way out but i just love the idea that like it's just a parking lot it's fine okay Got a statue, unicorn, and what's this other one? Is that like a lion? Alrighty. So I'm guessing find the three medallions. You can find a way out. Uh, I wonder if this. Well, that's just the smudges of the other one. Okay. The symbols are what is ruining my mind right now. I don't know what those. That's gonna have to do with it. But. All right. Cool. All right, turn to the main hallway. I'm about to get caught. All right, let's try out this leg thing I'm thinking about. Can't shoot? It stunned him enough, whatever. I probably didn't even need to do it. Nope, not that one. Not going that way. This is not the way. Jesus, they're everywhere. Going this way. Pop those doors let up. Met up. Don't know what that does. You got something, bud? Thank the maker. Alright. Looks like we got a bit of a fort here. Um, not getting through that. Great, they're splitting up. Are you kidding me? Frick, dude! He jumped at me! Holy junk! They, uh... They do quite a bit of lunge, don't they? I was thinking that was just gonna be an easy juke. Was I wrong? Goodness. Alright, come on. I keep wanting to hit buttons to help poor Leon here. Jeez. I'm really feeling you, feeling you full of the gore here. You're safe. Uh, that's more than I can say for you. Marvin Branagh. Marvin Branagh. Leon Kennedy. But there was another off I could... 
Don't get Leon's handsome face eaten off. I'll yeah. try. <laughs> Sure you did what you could, Leon. Does anyone know what started this? Not a clue. I'll get geared up. But honestly, all you need to know is that this place will eat you alive if you aren't careful. Yeah, well, I was supposed to start last week, and I got a call to stay away. I wish I'd come here sooner. Could have helped. <laughs> You're here now, Leon. That's all that matters. More or less. Okay, Lieutenant. I'm ready. Hopefully you'll be able to find a way out of this station. That officer you met earlier, Elliot. He thought this secret passageway might do the trick. Of course you're bleeding on the book. This is good news. We can get you to a hospital. No, no, I am not the priority here. Lieutenant, I'm not just gonna leave you here. I'm giving you an order, rookie. You save yourself first. I'd come with you, but I'd just slow you down. Now. You'll need this. I can't take it. Stop. Them. And don't make my mistake. If you see one of those things, uniform or not, you do not hesitate. That's sad, you man. Out, or you run. Got it? Yes, sir. <laughs> the faces are wonderful in this game. Gosh, he said to shoot his friends, and that sucks. Jeez. I can't imagine what an actual moment like this would be. Because that would just be hard to just shoot people, you know? And they're just not at all who they used to be. Alright. Equip on the inventory screen to use. This knife wears down with use. What? And it'll break when its gauge is depleted. Left bumper to ready it, right trigger to slash. Why isn't it trigger? Like, oh, well, I guess it's you can hold out your gun and you can hold out your knife. The knife isn't treated like a gun. It can be used to counterattack when you are caught by an enemy and can only be retrieved once you defeat them. Okay, so if we're gonna if we're gonna counterattack and we want to get the knife back, we need to uh, take them down. That weaken my knife if I cut it against things. Alright. Uh so you take health to health monitor bottle flash drop. Fine, caution. To danger. When in danger, quickly heal yourself with a green herb or aid spray before it's too late. Okay, yeah, so when you are in danger mode, you are literally dying. Um all well and good. Um is it X? Excellent. No puns intended, ever. Not on the stream. Not today, not ever. All right. I'm wondering. I guess I just need to get started. All right. Oh, cool. We don't have to like, the The amount of usability in these menus is just making me excited already. I'm I'm excited. This game is beautiful. Um, super pumped. Um, already super scared of failing amazingly. All right, so all the interesting thing is over in this place, which I hate. Um, and then we have this one door. So I think we're going to go through that. And maybe we'll figure out whatever this thing is. Um, oh, man. But at least I got everything in the rooms that I went in. That, that feels somewhat nice. All right. I'm going to need to get used to the knife gun thing here. Also, the you can move and shoot, but... You are definitely not uh, suggested to, I'm sure. All right, I like that we're both holding our sides here. All right, can't talk to him anymore. Just want to look around for a second. Um, man, it says I got everything in this room, so I guess let's just move on. Let's just move on. Next door. We're gonna we're gonna see if we can get one more nibble in before we have to use the healing spray. All right. Well torn key doesn't work storage room oh wait that's that's from the that's from the gas station why am i why do i still even have that all right we need a club club key i guess let's put the stupid other key away i don't even know if we need it but we got it for some reason 
thing's all taped up. We fixed it, I promise. Oh, that's the only reason they taped it up? So you had to have a meaningful uh, moment from this one guy this to get how I imagine my first day. I mean, when you're a kid, you always want to be a police officer, but this really makes it not worthwhile. All right. Leon's hurting a little bit. Yeah, no, he's 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 not having the best day, and I'm not I'm not helping that much. But uh, we're gonna we're gonna figure it out together. All right, extra eleven bullets. Thank you. I'm guessing I fit uh, I fit in a. Can I reload anymore? Okay. Okay, blood. And another door. I'm scared to use the knife. I'm scared to die. I'm scared to... Why did it get darker? All right, I'm scared for life. We might have to do that whole thing over again because <laughs> I'm gonna die. It's okay, it's okay. We're, uh, we're learning, we're learning. We just gotta keep moving. We gotta get that radio so we can try and call Brad and he just never answers. Don't. Man. This is never a good idea. Oh. Oh, what the fuck? Jeez. I don't know, there's this much uh, extra gore in this game. <laughs> Goodness. All right. Okay. Even if he turns, I don't think he would be. At least I don't think he would be that much of an issue. No key for the lucky charm door. That's a bad sign. Garbage disposal of some kind. Yeah, it wants us to go out. I don't want to turn my back on that yet. We're gonna have to use that, I imagine. You, bro. All right. Record of events. September 25th. We're turning the station to a temporary shelter due to the massive sudden outbreak. All police personnel have been instructed to make the safety of the citizens their top priority as we try to accommodate as many of them as possible. September 25th. Addendum. One of the refugees attacked us in the middle of the night, rests, uh, resulting in the death of one officer and injuring three others. The person in question, I thought I heard something, the person in question was quickly restrained. We believe this is a simple case of someone snapping under intense stress. Can we just talk about a giant infection? It's like, no, this guy's just stressed. All right, the 26th, the mob attacked the station today, resulting in a number of casualties. A few survivors were able to make it safely behind the emergency shutters. But, surrounded as we are, it'll be hard for any of us to escape this place. We're not sure if we can fix any of our comm equipment, so we remain cut off from the outside world. September 27th, there was another clash on the west side of the station around 1pm. 12 people died, and there is only one handful of survivors left. Only- oh, only a handful. <laughs> that is only one handful. So just the one. Um, everything is falling into disarray down here. David Ford. Real quick, let's read my acceptance letter or whatever the heck. Um, didn't I have a... Oh, wait. How do we... Oh, triggers. On behalf of the RPD, congratulations on completing your training, your especially high marks. Are to be commended, so we're an awesome rookie, is what we are. And we couldn't be prouder to have you as a member of our force. Please report for orientation at the Raccoon City Police Station on Friday, September 25th at 8 a.m. We look forward to serving with you. Raccoon City Police Chief... Brian Irons. Awesome. And these are all tutorial things I have already read. Um, cool, cool, cool. Tight, tight, tight. Alright, I need to be on the lookout for more uh, statues, man. Maps. Dang. Alright. There might be a way out over there. And there's a door in the back. So we're gonna have a friend in a minute, so... Well, we're making use of it. I'm just gonna walk for 
Frickin' A. Really? Alright. If I die, it's gonna suck. Can I shut off my flashlight? Is that even, like, a mechanic? He really wants those snacks. This is just Kevin from the office. Let's go into the west office, shall we? He's gonna get back up. Luckily, these rooms are pretty spacious so far. I haven't had to, like, run. Or I haven't had to not run for... Gunpowder! Can we, can we craft things in this game? Uses of gunpowder. The answer is yes! Uh, let's see. Two gunpowder make handgun ammo. That That's not exactly how it's made, but that's fine. Shotgun shells. Gunpowder and high-grade gunpowder. High grade, two high-grade gunpowders make mag ammo. There's not a lot of ammo left around the station, so make good use of any gunpowder you find. Different guns require different ammo, so pay attention when you're combining things, or you won't get what you need. Alright. Alright, there's a lot of blood going that way. <laughs> I'm just... Can I combine those? Excellent. Jojo, do you have anything? Okay. Alright, we need to go... We need to go in this room real quick. Oh, frick. That guy sounds mad. Alright. Don't know this yet. That zombie is my spirit animal. I feel ya. That was my time to run. When he, wait. Oh, no! Alright. Now it's time. <laughs> that, that, when he recoiled that last time, that was my time to go. Let's have a read now. That was <laughs> we learned. We learned more about running away. Now we're now we're gonna read a little bit. It's fine. It's fine. It's down to just me and three others. No weapons. No ammo. And too many skirmishes have drained us mentally and physically. We're not gonna make it. Officer Phillips once suggested we escape through the sewers. Okay. Apparently, there's a secret tunnel under the, under this place, left over from its museum days. Okay, so it was a museum. That's why it's all. This is a very ornate kind of uh, police department, honestly, with all the. Statues and what have you. Um, apparently a secret tunnel's in this place, left over from museum days. I brushed her idea off before, but now it's not sounding all that bad. <laughs> There's a way to escape. We're not gonna do it. Now it doesn't sound so bad, though. I mean, we almost died a million times, it's fine. Um, yeah, there's no proof. Uh, there's a tunnel, I mean, if you tried looking. Or that the sewers aren't infested with zombies, also an idea. Uh, but I don't want to sit here and want to die either. It's a long shot, but I'm going to try and find out what I can about that tunnel. Elliot Edward. Okay, and that's the guy who we got the stuff from. I'm really curious... Oh, okay, I know where I'm at now. I'm really curious on how worth it is to try and fully kill... Oh, no, guys. Oh, I'm actually really touched. It was my first day, and I got a sign? Oh, you guys... I can't believe you do this for me. I don't know why I find that so funny. Rookie's first assignment is all spattered in blood. Gosh, Leon S. Kennedy, we're putting you on a very special case for your first assignment. Your mission is to unlock your desk. Did they make like an escape room scavenger hunt for Leon? This is like the cutest police department I've ever heard of. The key to your success is in the initials of our first names. Oh, that's cute. Um, and very Resident Evil-like for a puzzle. Input the letters in order... Input the letters in order of our desks. <sighs> there are two locks. One on each side of your desk. Make sure you get them both. <laughs> Whoops, dropping things. It's like, make sure you figure out your puzzle. You'll get <laughs> three stacks of ammo and some healing spray. You're gonna need it. Um... Basically, your first task is to remember your fellow officers' names, but you figured that much out, right? Good luck, Leon. By the way, it might take a little work to get Scott to give you a straight answer. Lieutenant Branagh. Oh, or Branagh? Branagh? That's the guy who's bleeding out in the front there. Scrawled in the corner between drops of blood. Be glad you're not here, rookie. That's sad, man. I feel bad for my fellow police officers who I hardly have met. Like, ah, uh, like, there's just these nice guys, and they're, half of them are just bitten, some of them are cut in half, like, it's just a rough first day, man. Oh, here's my desk, okay. Alright, so this guy, 
Oh, this is a different guy. Oh, that's the other guy. Oh, this is the third guy. You guys suck. Alright. Alright, are you... Some bad shot. That was... Yeah. I'm glad he curses when I miss, because that makes me feel a little bit better that... He knows I'm messing up. Alright. How well do we think that I can... Are you kidding me? Sit back down, you bastard. Alright. M. Crap. Are you... We're just gonna die today. Oh, good lord. Okay. We're just gonna... We're gonna aggro all the zombies until we can feed them all into a single place. We're gonna... Oh, this is a bad idea. Alright, gotta make a decision here. Well... Oh, wow. Alright. Get stabbed. I want that back, bro. Wow. That's rough, man. Ugh. You're such a nice co-worker. I can't believe you. Stay down. Are you kidding me? Can I stomp him? Can I stomp his head? Dang, dude. Wow, maybe I was wrong to, to do this on this mode. I really want my knife back. I'm not getting it back. I'm dying today. <laughs> no! Run! Woof, brother. Holy junk. Whew. Damn. My coworkers are so damn kind. Gosh, they'll just eat your face off with kindness. Damn. All right. Um, I think I can do this, but I know for a fact that uh, it's gonna be rough. Dang. Uh, get it? Okay, the aiming is a little funky. Well, the the I feel like what I hate the most is how much they bob around. Um, which is to be expected with zombies. And I'm not 100% sure if going for the head is actually the most the most optimal at this point. Um, dang, man. That's that's real easy to get gotten, that. Woof. Baby, I'm getting demolished over here. That's rough. <laughs> okay, we've been going for an hour, and I am... I am already depressed at how terrible I am. This is great. All right, if I continue, what happens? I'm very curious because uh, you bring the shabby, shabby shambling to a stop with a bright flash of light. I can flash them. That's that's cool. All right, so we're gonna have to go through some of that again, uh, which of which I'm aware. Oh, okay, we got a quick inventory. Cool, cool, cool. Um, get all this again. Okay, I generally know what I'm doing, and I feel good about it. Other than the fact that I failed hardcore. Um I think I can do this. We're gonna we're gonna give the rest of the night a shot. Are my footprints bloody or those someone else's? Those are someone else's. That's fine. That's fine. Everyone's fine here. Um so yeah, dude, that that was freaking intense. I really like that. I'm just wondering if I'm better off just going for the chest. Or if I should just go for legs and just run around them as they crawl. Because I'm trying to think of the best way to do it since I'm on hard and I know ammo conservation and like not fully killing everything is going to help me, but. Dang. Dang, bro. Holy junkers. I'm, I, I, I'm glad I've gotten a little bit, or to know a little bit more of how, uh, how the zombies move and what I need to do to get around them and fight them. But goodness. All right, we're gonna we're gonna give this another shot. We might take a quick break, um, but when we come back, we're we're definitely gonna give this. We're gonna give this another go around. Chunk. <laughs> or this might be a really long playthrough. I don't know if this. I doubt. I highly doubt this game actually allows you to change the difficulty when you're already in it, which is fine because I really kind of wanna. I wanna stick with this. I wanna stick with the difficulty. But oh man. God bless anyone who wants to watch me play this, because I'm going to be dying a lot, a lot, a lot. Oh, man, I am so excited. Oh, this is going to be so good. It's going to be so good. Um, but, yeah, I think I'm going to be, like, gone for two to three minutes, 
and we'll uh, we'll be right back with some more Resident Evil and death. Oh goodness gracious, this is this is this is gonna be a fun one. We'll be right back.